I wanted to start this one off today and I wanted to let you know that the grind will go unnoticed, but your results never will, family. I want you to keep grinding. I want you to keep pushing. I want you to keep studying what's going on in the market so that you can be as successful as possible. And speaking of studying the market, it's time to be a student, baby. I want to see some headphones in the chat. We got to talk about where it's at. Check it out. This is not financial advice, understand, but this is the facts. Remember, you be the judge. The CPI data, AKA inflation data, consumer price index, according to the New York Times, it came in and it's remaining stubbornly high. AKA, if it's 8.3% right now, that means it's 8.3% higher for the same things that you were buying last year. So you gotta pay more and more and more and you're getting less and less and less. This is what happens to people when they are poor. This is what happens to people when they are in the middle class. We always end up picking a bill when the government and the Federal Reserve make these decisions. But let's keep it going, family. We gotta get to the facts. It says this. They got three bullet points for us. And the very first one says inflation came in faster than expected in August, even as gas prices fell. Let me know if the gas prices fell in your area. They came down crazy in my area, but quiet as it's kept. That's not the only part of inflation, family. When you go to the gas station, oh yeah. If you wanna buy some chicken, you wanna buy some lettuce, no matter what, you wanna buy some ketchup and mustard it's through the roof. It's way higher than it was last year. So just bringing the gas prices down, that wasn't enough. People's rents is crazy high, right? The back to school supplies that the people had to pay for their kids to do when people wanted to get their kids who were going to college for the first time, they wanted to get them into a car, they want to finance a car, interest rates is through the roof, family. It's more than just gas. So this is why inflation is all the way up. It says this, there's a report that dampens Biden's attempt, President Joe Biden, his attempt to celebrate the economy. So they're telling us that the government is celebrating that the economy is great. Meanwhile, the stock market has been coming down basically all year because inflation has been high. We had a few little pops, but it's been coming down, down, down. And we hearing that they're celebrating that the economy is great. This is out of pocket. I'll let you be the judge, though. You make your own conclusions. And on the bottom, it says the market plunges on higher than expected inflation numbers. They expected it to be 8.1%, which is crazy. No, nah, family, it wasn't 8.1% higher than last year. It was basically 8.3%. So they expected it to be high and it was even higher than that. So a lot of the regular people is getting smoked. I'm telling you, you go to the grocery store, you try to buy some food, you get smoked. You try to get a new car and you got to lease it, you get smoked on the interest rates, you get smoked on the prices. You try to go and rent somewhere out, you get smoked all around the board, family. Real estate, food, everywhere, except you know what? The gas prices is down, but let's keep it going, family. What does this mean and how is this actionable? A lot of people like to subscribe to the channel because I'm giving you the facts so you know where it's at, but then I tell you what actions you could expect coming forward. And right here, we see that it says that according to Bloomberg, one of the most reputable sources in the stock market, that they should do 100 basis point meaning 1% interest rate hike. Before, they've been doing half of a percent. They've been doing three quarters of a percent. Now we're saying that the Fed is gonna go harder and raise the interest rates up basically 1%. This is what people are starting to expect because inflation is still burning up hot. Now, how does this impact you? You keep hearing about rate hikes, rate hikes, rate hikes. It's just like this. When you see mortgages, it's saying that mortgages, 6% family. Not even a few months ago, you could have got in a new mortgage for in the 2% range, family. Now they all the way up at 6%. I'm talking about when you want to go and finance or lease a new car, like I was saying, where, you know what, your kids is going back to school. You might have some new first college generation kids. You know what I'm saying? You take your kids to college, boom, they try to get a new lease. Oh man, the interest rate is through the roof now. They're trying to make money more expensive to bring down inflation and they might have to go harder. Now, you got to understand, how do you handle stuff like this in this day and time? We got to be aware that in 2022, the difference between success and failure is information. And for that reason is why I partner with the Tendies app, which gives you that information where other apps are charging you $40, $350 for the same information that Tendies is offering for free. Let's go through it and let me show you how you could use it. And if you got iOS, you could get on the app right now. The link is pinned to the top comment. But if you got Android, again, get in the link in the top comment. They got it on the desktop for us too, baby. Now, check it out. When you look at it, you can look at the options flow. 
you can look at ticker details i'm talking apple microsoft tesla whatever amc whatever and you can see how the whales the people who are buying a lot of it how are they getting down how are they getting busy remember access to information is key because then you are not walking around in the market ignorant you get to see what the big dogs is buying you get to see what the big dogs are selling you get to see how they are betting in the market and for how long let me give you a perfect example let's look at this right here i just categorized all the way out the spy the fortune 500 companies what i'm gonna show you right now is look at the very top i got a red arrow now at the head of the red arrow, you can see that it's saying September 16th. At the back of it, it's 58,000 premium. They basically are betting $58,000 on a put option that the SPY, the Fortune 500 companies, is gonna come down and approach 393. This doesn't mean that it will, but this means that they're willing to put $58,000 on that. Now you can see there are three more arrows and you can see even to October, they're saying that they can see it coming down to 380. And they put 115,000 on that. You see the next one, the third one down, they're saying 390 for October 21st. They put almost $60,000 on that. And then there's just one bet that in the very short term, aka September 14th, they put 92K on that. So what they're saying is there's a story here. The big dogs is telling us, again, access to information, that they see the market doing a little bit of a pop up from where it is right now. From being so sold off to then coming back down in the midterm family this is what the big dogs is telling us they, they anticipate a pop and then a drop so that's how we got to look at these kind of things so with this in mind what i decided to do was start a ten dollar challenge for 10 weeks family this is over on the discord where the focus here is discipline accountability and building out your banger position in a blue chip company family if you want to be a part of an accountability group because a lot of us i told you people they will not see the grind that you're in family but your results will speak for themselves we're going to help you to get those results we just helped so many different people get to five thousand dollars that many people have never had now they got five thousand dollars in cash and we're moving forward and we're starting to now get into another challenge where we're going to invest ten dollars using discipline again and again and again holding each other accountable in many different ways the discord link is pinned in the description so i want you to join over there i'll see you over there and you can get in on that challenge i got a whole video i got a whole everything planned out for you so for you to be successful family i'm here i'm telling you this i want you to be on point and i want you to not compare yourself to other success you got to compare yourself to who you were yesterday that's who i want you to be and that's what i'm going to help you to beat the person that you were now I want to even just say this i put out this 10 dollar challenge for the next 10 weeks and i'm hearing even school teachers talking about yo you know what i'm a regular person and i'm trying to build my wealth up but i never had the opportunity and now i see you wrote the blueprint for me to succeed i'm joining that so i want to say shout out to you and i see you in the discord for that family Ma major respect and much love and right here i've seen some people posting on instagram posting how we working with the challenge we just started and they're showing us look they got ten dollars put it on a public app and then boom they said put me on what is this right i'm pumped to see people are engaged and people are happy about building wealth slowly but surely right this mindset is going to transition and then help you to increase your positions at all of the banger companies that have helped you to be killing it in a game family now why is this stuff important why is getting to five thousand dollars when we did the 26 week challenge why was that important why is now doing this new challenge important understand that it's getting crazy out here it says this 49 percent of americans couldn't cover a 400 dollar emergency expense today which is up 32 percent from in november this was posted on may 26 family and you see that inflation is still crazy high so that 400 dollars expense they couldn't cover is probably a 300 dollars expense now baby so you got to get with the winners you got to get with people who got specific plans it's time to kill it in the market it's time to build some wealth and understand what to do on the way down i see you over there on the discord and i see you over there on the attendees app i love y'all but if you can't handle the heat of these hot stocks in this bear market then stay out of the kitchen Consider investing in the index funds. I love y'all. Take care.